You just said about how the evil reveals when there are certain relations between the friends. The question is, if a person sitting on his own someplace, studying through the internet, if he has no mutual work with another person, how is it revealed if I don't know another person? I don't get it. I see that people are getting on Facebook. I never got on Facebook. Never went there. I don't know. I heard the name. I see how they talk about it, about the different social networks. Also, never been to one of those. But I see that people live inside that network. That they, you know what? They get married. He's in love, uh, a man and a woman, suppose, uh, you know, it's something that... And if it's, uh, if it turns out that it's really a man and a woman. In the past, I used to go with the Rabash, we used to pass near this place. Uh, where we used to have our walks. Then when we passed next to the football stadium, he said, we have to respect this place. Tell me, to respect such a place, what? He says, this place gives people joy. The same with the internet, with all the garbage that's there. It connects, it connects between people. It invokes them to bring out all their evil, hate, envy, lust, lies, whatever, what not. But through that, we realize many, plenty of Rashimot, many Rashimot. The whole of humanity is there, and the whole of humanity are lying and arguing. They want to cheat each other in one way and another way, and they're arguing. You know what that is, what kind of work that is. Where could you bring them? To which place, which field could you bring them all to? Where? Meaning, we see that through the virtual connection, people realize the Rashimot. Why can't we realize our Rashimot in a good way, also through the virtual connection? I'm sure that the entire internet developed only for that purpose.